Hi, I'm Debbie, and welcome to my channel, Divine Destiny with Debbie. Today, I'm reading for February 11th and 12th, General Energies for Cancers. Hello, my Cancers. How are you? You do, You doing okay? You holding up? I really hope you are. Um, you know, I do I do hold you in my, my heart. I pray for all my subscribers, but I do pray for my Cancers, too. You've been going through a lot. Okay, as, you know, this is General Energy. Now, this is a short reading. So because it's a short reading, I use only my Doreen Virtue Angel Tarot cards. I pray, meditate, and infuse with Reiki energy all my readings, okay? Um, but also, this is a general reading. It may or may not resonate with you. Take what you like, leave the rest. It's all good. It's all good. Um, I do, I have posted my longer readings, the 15th through the 28th. Please take a look at those. I look at those as more as chapters and these general energies as the pages of the chapters. Okay, so let's go on and, and shuffle and see what's going on. I'm still feeling a lot, you know, this Monday and Tuesday, I'm still feeling a lot of support from your archangels. I'm feeling like they're, I really feel like they've been holding you in big, big hugs. I hope you've been feeling that energy and accepting that energy. I know that even if you're watching me, it doesn't always mean that you accept <laughs> because you know, I mean, because that, that other world is a little bit on the... Oh, okay. So we we have a bunch of cards that flipped up for me. And so what we're going to do is we're going to flip them down. There's a whole bunch of cards. So I really feel like, you know, they, as I was shuffling, that's what I was looking at to see what these cards, what, what hand, what did in my hand. So now we actually have five cards. So we're going to do this quick. Oh my gosh. And they're all, well, except for that last card, they're all reversed. And so a reverse card, um, many readers will read them as the opposite message. Um, some readers say, no, nope, don't even worry about that. What I say is that this means, you know, please pay attention to the message. Not that we should pay attention to the other messages, but this is like, hey, you know, talking to you, guy, talking to you, girl, listen. Okay, so these are all face down. The first one is our seven of water. Okay, water is your sign. A complex decision, the need to do research. Stop procrastinating. You have been in such a, you know, you have been in such, you've been getting pounded so much that you, you know, I feel like you've been just kind of like this, you know, like this, and you're just trying to hold on and maintain. And the thing is, you still have to go forward. Remember, those direct, those planets are still going, um, you know, forward. They're still pushing you forward. And you just want to curl up in that little ball. So this is telling you, uncurl and start looking at things. And maybe start, you know, start looking at things and start taking care of you. And I don't necessarily mean health-wise and sleep. I think you've been doing a little bit more sleeping. Um, but it's like getting prepared for that future because that future will be here very shortly. So these are two days that will be good to do that in. Okay, this one, let's see what this one says. And this one is the High Priestess, Archangel Haniel. And this is listen to your intuition, have patience, consider carefully what you want before acting. So this is again that thing of preparation. I really feel, and again, okay, High Priestess, high intuition, high gut. You know, your gut is telling you what to do. Thing is, though, you, you know, when you listened to your gut, bef what, well, when you listened to what you thought was your gut, it was actually what you really kind of wanted. You kind of superseded your gut with maybe with a romantic notion, you know. Oh, yes, you know, and, and again, I'll take these just kind of painting a picture from my experiences, you know. Okay, oh, yes, that's the guy that I'm going to love forever. Well, it's more, you know, but inside my gut is like, oh, stop this now. Don't go forward. But my wants, my, you know, my heart and my brain, my heart and my mind is saying, oh, yes, go ahead. Look at how well, look at he, he, he checks off all what you've been looking for. And my gut, no, don't do it. Or I have had that same thing with jobs, you know. Oh, this, look at this. It makes really good money. It's good hours. It's good this, this, this. No, don't do it. You know not to do it. And, you know, so that's what I'm saying is that you do have this. The thing is, is separating, uh, separating, I don't know, is separating or 
saying to your mind and your heart, remember, your, you know, mind, heart, spirit, spirit can be soul, spirit can be intuition, telling your mind and heart, hey, it's my turn, my turn, listen to me, listen to me, okay? Because you do have, you know, your water, your emotions, you're flowing, you, you seep into things, okay? You do have this. Um, so actually, so, you know, it, so this is kind of going along with that thing. Start moving forward. It's okay. You're also being, you're also being guided, okay? But let's keep going on. This is because this is just for like Monday and Tuesday. This one again, the star. Oh my gosh, more Archangel um, energy. Archangel Jophiel. So you had Michael, and I think you had Gabriel, and I think you even had Ariel, and now we're having, you know, we're having um, Haniel and Jophiel come out. Happy times. Make positive, optimistic, long-term plans on the right path. Again, we're going. So, you know, just, so they're saying, hey, if you get up, have some energy and start working on these things because we're here to help you, okay? Again, reversed. And here we have fire, five of fire. Fire is our Leo Aries and our Sagittarius energy. And fives is always about change. And this one says competing goals, bothersome details, conflict with others. Yes, yes, and yes. But then what this is, take your water. Take your, Yeah, it's going to be busy. These are going to be two busier days. More, more um, intellectually busy, more mind busy, more... You know, how do I handle this busy? Um, so take your water and put out or dampen that fire. I don't mean about being busy, but I'm talking about the conflict with others. You know, basically, hey, you know what? You are not going to be bothering me. You're not going to make me stop. You're not going to make me cringe anymore. Whatever this you is, your work, person, whoever. So let's see, you know, let's see what this next card is and this one is the nine of earth and the nine of earth is you know the earth is virgo taurus and it's um capricorn it's what you feel it's money it's home and this one is enjoying life's little luxury spending quiet time alone successful self-employment so basically monday morning you know Tell yourself enough is enough. I've got to start working. I got you know. I started. I have to start going forward. I have to. I've got Archangel. I've got divine, divine guidance helping me. I've got this, and I'm accepting it. I've got divine guidance helping me. You know, excuse me, but screw you, people who people or situations who are trying to stop me. Yeah. You know, that, again, that word. I have divine guidance, and I am going to get this. I want you to actually pull in your inner fire, okay? I want you to say, yay, hey, enough is enough. I'm going forward. Now, you may not be able to change those, those other situations, but you can take what it is because, you know, you can, you know, say, no, I am no longer that victim anymore. And, I, and again, when I say that, it's not, it's because, yeah, many times over you were a victim, okay? It's not that you had that mentality. Well, you continue, you, know, you have to have help. That's a bigger, that's a bigger thing, okay? But, but, you know, you are actually coming out. I feel like you're like, you know, you're, you're coming out. Um, you're like that sun rising, okay? Because really, in the long run, things are going to be really, really good, Okay? Yeah, you've got divine guidance. You continue with your divine guidance. Reach out for it. Okay? Cancer! Wow! Wow! You're becoming that you're becoming kick butt. You know, you're you're kicking you're gonna you're gonna get to a point and you're gonna be like, that's not who I am. I love my home. I love my family. No, but you can be that one. Okay, you can be that uh that warrior. Even though okay, yeah. Okay, so cancers, as always, know that you are loved. Hey divine guidance, and be blessed. Bye-bye.